Hey, yo, what's up? You know what it is. The one and only triple the G-O-D. And it's Jack King. Yo, um, good evening, Internet. Good evening, world. How's everybody doing? Um, we just wanted to bring you some spe- a special episode of Two Niggas Speak on. It's been a minute since we've done this, but today is a historic and momentous day in the history of human events or some shit like that. Um... I like I like to start with a, a personal. Y'all missed this conversation a couple of conversations ago. I fucking told you, Jay. Fucking told your ass. Yeah, yeah, you did. I, I didn't want to believe they was gonna do this shit, but yeah, you're right. Well, uh, I, I, you made me eat my word. Yo, or Square Enix made me eat my words. Whatever. I'm like, you really, you really honestly fucking think that that shit wasn't gonna happen, dog? For real? You really? Uh, actually, I don't. But well. I mean, do, do you, let, let's let's move it on and get into it. Um, Kingdom Hearts two point eight. Yeah, it was a surprise. No, but I have some I have some concerns though, or some dislikes. Well, sorry. Um, please, please let me know what your yeah, concerns uh, are, and I will do my best to address your fears, sir. Go right ahead. Okay. Well, well, I, I noticed the. Things they've been doing with with these Kingdom Hearts HDs, they're just HDs. They should have been remastered. You know, that's that's just me though. I, I some other people like this shit, but I honestly think they should have took the time to fucking remaster all these shit correctly. Because when you don't remaster the shit, you get burnt by sleep. The identical. PSP version on the big screen and the shit don't look right. So yeah, they they, they fail with that. They they fail. Well that that camera angle that camera angle should have been pushed all the way back. This, we we're not playing PSP anymore. There's no way in hell this that camera angle should have been that close up. I understand you had to do that shit for a small ass screen, but I got a fucking forty seven inch television. I'm not trying to see that shit all close up like that. Okay. I'm just saying. Okay. I'm just saying. Okay. Okay. I will I will address you. For my understanding, based off what I've seen and mostly off what the fuck we have had conversations about, I understand that the Square Enix's H D remasters, quote unquote, 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 have not been of the best quality in the fucking world. But I, I will I will fuck I will fucking address the upside of all of this so far. They are at least gathering all this stuff in a way that players can get all this shit mostly in one place. Uh, I'm like, at this juncture, I'm, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say this live. At this juncture, I would appreciate having um the original chain of memories on on the eShop. I would appreciate that for someone who enjoyed that version of the game, just so if. People have never experienced that before to play the game the way it was originally intended. I can fuck with that. Okay, I agree. Okay, yeah. okay. When it comes to the to the HD remaster shit, at least you niggas getting final mixes though. You you talking to yeah. the nigga who <laughs> played both who played Final Mix one and two in complete other Japanese, just so I can say I played that shit. So, for everybody who getting their taste now on PS3, and possibly, because there ain't no motherfucking way that um that 1.5 and 2.5 will not be on PS4 to follow up that shit, you're going to be able to get all that in one place. And when we had that conversation, that's all the fuck I was telling you, was that they got to uh-huh. get all this shit in a central focus point. For all you X, for all you X, for, for all you bone stands, y'all not getting this shit. So, if either if either if either get down, get a PS4, or lay down with your bone, nigga. If you trying to play all the old Kingdom Hearts shit, that's just how the fuck it's right. gonna be because of how contracts work. Because if they wanted to have those games on Xbox, they would have came out the same time as PS4. Now, I haven't heard if 2.8 is even gonna be on Xbox. I have no idea. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know, but. I don't know, okay, because see, here, here's the other part where I sit on the other side of these 8 day remaster shit. 
I understand how niggas feel about 358, how Recoded isn't technically a video game, but I would have liked the opportunity to play those games. Would just exactly. like, would like the opportunity to experience those games or to give players the chance to experience those games the way they were. Because recently, I went on the eBay spree and when it got all those games thinking I was going to play them, still haven't yet. Want to, because I don't want, I'm like, as much as it's going to be simple when I finally sit down and play that shit and just press X through cutscenes to get a fucking platinum in that shit. Because it's a platinum in that game for watching all those cutscenes or is it just a gold trophy for that? I don't think so. Uh, because I, I have to go check the trophy list. I, I honestly don't think you get a platinum from that shit. That makes it sad. But I'm like, my thing was, it, it, I'm like, and I'm going I'm to say, say this live for the internet. Even after the million and billion times you told me, T, you don't need to play 358, I want to because it's not fair for me, for a person who has been in the game. From Kingdom Hearts 1 to right now to be fucking... I'm going to skip 358 because I can watch the fucking cutscenes. I'm, I'm too fucking pot committed at this juncture to do so. And to bring up a point that you made in that same conversation we had a while back. Is that I asked you a question about if you were... If you had a second chance to be... I have never played Kingdom Hearts in my life. To play it in a way that makes sense. Tell the streets what the fuck you told me, dog. Tell the streets what you told me. I will I will recommend anyone, including myself, if I would have had a chance to go back and play this shit again, to start with Burnt My Sleep. For story purposes. The, the PS That's what I would recommend. The the PSP version or, or Final Mix on PS3? Uh, I'll probably say the PSP version. Because that's the way it was originally intent to be played. So I will ask you this in rebuttal then. Just fuck with you. Just fuck with me for a second. If if you had an option to lay out for the motherfucking internet and story order and possible best gameplay experience, would you recommend that a person play the original version of a game where available, like, let me explain it before I let you answer. If you got Final Mix, if you can get, because it's like, at this point, I'm going to tell you on wax, for the internet, just so you know, somebody a couple of years ago, Dander translated all the Final Mix, Bird by Sleep on PSP. The first two <laughs> Kingdom Hearts game final mixes have been fully translated on PS2. If you want to play them, if you had to choose between Chain of Memories or Rechain, whether that's on PS2 or part of or part of 1.5, whether the fuck you gonna play some bullshit like Recoded, whether you gonna play fucking 358 over two days, I'm gonna throw the question back at you, and I want you lay lay it out. For me, lay it out for the internet. Let let them know how you feel about that shit. Cause I want, cause I want to know how you feel about that. I want to know. I I will only recommend them playing the original versions of the game if they still have all of the systems that they go to. If niggas trade the shit in and they don't have the shit no more, then stick to the fucking HD versions of them. That's that's what I recommend. So. If if somebody could get their hands on Final Mix One and Two, the translated versions on PS2, would you recommend they play those over or what's part of One Point Five and Two Point Five? Yes, I would recommend they play those. But if that option is not available, then just stick to the HD shit because that's too much of a hassle just just to go back and play that shit like that when you don't have it readily available. Next question: Chain or rechain? Shit, you already know the fucking originals, motherfucker. You, Original chain, Game Boy, goddamn shit. You, you know what? I, I'm 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 saying this live on wax, nigga. One of the things when Jay get nine busy and we get back in the fucking cooking work, nigga, we gotta do that one thing we never ever fucking did, dog. 
We gotta do that dual oh, shit. Boy, you do. We been talking. We been talking about doing that shit for years, and we never fucking did it. I got a Game Boy player. You got fifty Game Boy, Game Boy cores and shit for GameCube, nigga. We gotta do that shit, dog. One time, dude, man. I'm like, I want to show the internet that I spent a very long fucking time getting multiple copies of every single car in Chain of Memories because at that point I had not shit to do at all. Nothing. Didn't do shit. <laughs> Didn't do shit. But. Didn't do shit, but go through the final room and just keep and just keep fucking reloading cars and just whacking shit. Like I got all these keyblades, the fuck I'm gonna do with it? I'm like, I can smash more Lucy in two combos now because I'm level 99 and shit. But I'm just gonna keep getting these cars because I ain't doing shit. I ain't doing shit. Seriously, back on topic though. Does does somebody at this juncture do they watch the cutscenes or do they play three five eight? Regardless of all of its semi multiplayer bullshit. Me. Well, from a personal experience, I will say watch the cutscenes because that game is that horrible to me. That to me, that is the worst in the series. I, I cannot fuck with three five eight, man. I I just can't, dude. Um, same thing for same thing for Recoded. Do do you watch the cutscenes on two or do you fucking play Recoded for the actual Re- two seconds? Recoded. When Recoded came out. I didn't even know it came out. I was like, what the fuck? Damn. Really? Damn. I saw this shit like, wait a minute. When did this come out? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck was going on, man. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, I'll probably say go ahead and watch the cutscenes for that too. So. Alright, so just a review. At this, what you want, what you let in there know? Because I'm just trying to throw it back and let them know what the fuck we didn't just spend like five minutes in. If you have the opportunity to play a game in this original form, I agree with Jay, and, and it's what I suggest, because that's how we came up. If I would have fucking known back in 2002 that in 2000, 2013, I would have been able to play an HD remix version of a game that I imported at the same time I bought this nigga $200 worth of soundtracks off eBay for that same exact shit, I would play the PS3 version. You still got you still got the motherfucking soundtracks, don't you? Of course I do. You I'm just, know I do. I'm just asking. I'm just asking, nigga. That shit was expensive, dog. Nigga, e- eBay a bitch. I, I know it was expensive, but yeah, I still got it. Nigga, shout the Melty Blood for one time, nigga. We need to play that shit, man. I'm like, well, that was one of the first games I imported, dog. Man, I mean, we was at the library, yeah. nigga. We saw, I saw that picture on the Magic Box, nigga. What the fuck is that shit? I went on eBay during a library session and imported that motherfucker played that shit. Me and Bob was talking about that shit. We was over here playing Raid of the Dragons. You need to watch that video. But uh-huh. like I said, it's like I'm just, and and I, and I feel the same way Jay do about this shit. If you can somehow experience what 1.5 and 2.5 bring to the table in this original form, I suggest playing that because you get that feel of that shit. And then if you want to go back and supplement what the fuck you played, I'm fucking with you. But don't do one or the other. Do both. Most of y'all ain't got no motherfucking time to be doing shit anyway. So fill your time with playing a game, then playing the remix of that game, then playing the HD remix of it. You ain't doing shit. You ain't doing right. shit at all. So I'm just saying, do that. Do fucking that. Oh, one more question. Because the subject... Or the whole thing was the one thing I forgot to ask you. Does a motherfucker go get the 3DS and go play um and go play 3D, or do they wait on 2.8? You know what? From the trailer, I'm actually curious to see how it plays on the PS4. So I'm gonna say wait just to see how it plays. If it plays better on the PS4 versus the 3DS, then obviously go for the PS4 version of it. So. I'm like, I, I don't know. We have to wait and see. For the motherfucker on his telephone who played more than two minutes of 3D, don't that flow motion shit have something to do with fucking touchscreen controls or something? Or what? It it can, but I'm trying to think. Oh, wait. The PS4 got a fucking touch pad, so yeah, I guess does, you so could that, kind of sort of make that work if you want that, to. That, that probably why... They bring that shit off for the PS4, I guess. I don't know. Can't, they can't do that shit for a Kinect. Oh, wait. Microsoft pretends the Kinect doesn't exist anymore. So, there you have it. Yeah. Yeah. 
So, but yeah, I, I'll, I'll say I'll say wait to see how the PS4 version plays, and we'll just go from there. Right. So, final. But, but let's, let's let's get to the most exciting part of the fucking trailer was fucking Aqua. Oh my! Oh my! After Aqua made up. <laughs> oh, you mean? Oh, you mean? Oh, oh, you mean? Um, oh, you mean? Um. You mean Oliver Queen switched the back? Oh shit! Bring it on, son. Yeah, yeah. And, and and that and that looked like it was the uh, King of Hearts three graphics when she made her appearance. Like, what the fuck is this shit? Is, is this gameplay? Is this a cutscene? What the fuck is this? They say it's supposed. To, um, they. This is what the internet has brought to my attention and made me understand is that it's supposed to be like. A small gameplay demo that leads into Kingdom Hearts 3. That is what... That's why the game is called Kingdom Hearts 2.8, from what I'm understanding. Because it's Kingdom Hearts okay. 3 minus, and you're going backwards, to the birth by sleep 0 0.2, which equals 2.8. I'm like... I I know I know okay. Square Enix had the math jokes like that. I ain't know y'all yeah, yeah, knew how to subtract the motherfucking number. But fucking sue me. So... I'm like, this is going to be an interesting... This is going to be an interesting year for Kingdom Hearts, yo, because... Yep. I'm like... I don't know if this is going to be what it is that's going to finally get that... Should finally kick me up the ass and finish playing Birth by Sleep on PSP. Because I was playing that shit using... The, I was playing that shit, hook the PSP up to the computer, use the visual thing just so I could use the PS2 controller with it. But I don't know if I want to hook... I don't know if I want to hook up a PS3 that bad... To play a game that I read that was actually created for that was created for a portable console. Because from my understanding is that from what you said and based off what I've seen and heard from other folks is that at Birth by Sleep Final Mix on PS3, the, the camera controls aren't the best in the world. That's what they're, I, they're not. It's, because it's kind it, of it's, it's basically basically it basically plays like you got a giant ass PSP on the screen basically that's that's what it looks like so like okay yeah. whatever yeah I guess because on my little setup I had I had the right analog stick as the as the camera control and shit like that and I was able to get that set up and it played just like I was playing Kingdom Hearts like on a console and shit which is why I just need you to just throw out there that yo square if y'all trying to fucking remaster something Duo Decim, maybe? I don't know. Fuck with your boy, please. Because that was supposed to be a PS2 game if we got moved it up to the PSP. Fuck with your boy. That's all I'm saying. I need to go I don't Go fuck with that, but yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm just saying, like, that. that's, that's kind of... I don't know. Like, why would they do that? And they about to come out with the new joint. Man, but that's arcade. That's something completely separate. I really think I really think that that's something they should do. What do you mean, okay, ain't they bring on the PS4 as well? The game coming out a year later on PS4. That's the last thing I heard about it. I haven't heard anything about the City Arcade since they announced Bart and fucking Leon. They haven't said a thing about that. I haven't heard a thing about that game since, and that was like at least three or four months ago. I've heard nothing, not a damn thing. And I try my best to keep up with that game because I'm really interested to really look at gameplay footage and upload gameplay footage for people to see when that game finally come the fuck out. But it'll be what the fuck it be. Really quickly, before we get into our other subject for today, I need to hear your thoughts on Pokemon Tournament because I don't know if I've even ever asked you about your honest opinions. Uh -huh. Other... other other than the fact that a quote from you a long time ago is, I wish the video game was like the anime. I really think at this juncture, Pokemon Tournament, sir, is probably the closer motherfucking ass gonna get to that dream you had so yeah. long ago. Yeah. I, I, I mean, I can't complain. You can control a fucking Pokemon in real time and use Poke moves and shit and combos. I fucks with it. I can't wait till it come out. So, well, 
spring 2016, they officially just announced that Pikachu Libre, um, that Pikachu Libre variant for the arcade version. So I think finally, DOAGX the Dojo might finally be uploading some footage because I think Nanko Bandai don't really give a monkey shit if I do or don't. So I've been waiting for an excuse and I right. think this might be the one. So I'll be having some footage up on, on the other page soon. So streets be watching for that. Um, the one other thing that I need to personally talk about, I don't know if Jay has any input, because I have been on the internet, you know, letting fools know all day about this King of Fighters 14 shit, on the internet all day. Been on Gaff all day long, and all the fuck I heard on the internet is what the game look like when you have no idea how to fuck the video game play. Look, I'm going to say this live for the motherfucking internet. For all you motherfucking doubters that think SNK can't do 3D fighting, Go import King of Fighters Maximum Impact Regulation 8. Come back to me when you've done that shit, because from the way the internet look, I think I may be one of maybe 10 people in the history of the world who's played that motherfucking game. So, I need you to go do that. I'm like, I had to sit up here and let a motherfucker know this morning my opinions about SNK and their 3D output. And it... Just like, they had games on the Hyper Neo Geo 64, which were pretty fucking decent, that I enjoyed, mainly Samurai Showdown 64 2, and fucking, um, and fucking Wild Ambition, those were good games, um, we don't talk, no one talks about Samurai Showdown Sin unless you're trying to get into an argument with niggas, no one wants to hear about Warriors Rage on PS1 because that game is bad, um, and the Maximum Impact series is the Maximum Impact series, there is a reason, folks, that, that 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 Maximum Impact One is the highest selling game SNK has ever made in the history of the fucking company, or maybe that was because they had actual commercials on TV. Because I remember seeing that com- I remember the first time I saw that commercial on TV because it was in the middle of an episode of You You Hawker Show on Cartoon Network. Why does everything always come back to You You Hawker Show? Note to self: review. 120% full power for the internet. Do that. Do that. Look, folks. Hey. They, ju- they just showed the fucking game this morning, yo. So I just need the internet to just come down like 30 fucking decibels and just relax until you get something. Niggas did the same shit when the visuals for Street Fighter 4 came out. It's not in three. It's not in. It's not pixels anymore. We are sad face. Game looks fine. Kyo and Ori look fine. The gameplay look like KOF. You can't really ask for much more than that, folks. So, bring it down. Calm the fuck down. And let's wait until we get some stuff. And then you, you, you'll be fine once you see my tits. Because that's what gets you all in the... In the no, for real. Oh, you laughing at me. I'm serious. When King of Fighters... When King of Fighters 13 was going through the motions when I was uploading 50 million videos of this shit a day. All the fuck I heard was, if Ma's not in the game, I'm not buying the game. Ma was in the game, and Jay, can you guess what happened? Those same motherfuckers never bought the fucking video game. So, what were you doing all that bitching for, for a game you're not gonna fucking buy? I'm like, shit. I'm like, as much as I'm not a fan of King of Fighters 13 in any way, because I'd rather play King of Fighters Neo Wave if you gave me a fucking choice. Because it's nothing but a carbon copy of King of Fighters 2002. Anyway, it's like I said. To the point, internet. King of Fighters 14, calm y'all motherfucking asses down. That's all I'm at. I'm just asking. From the one and the only to you, just calm down. I understand that it's off-putting right now. And that because it's in 3D, it's hard for you to swallow after coming off... King of Fighters 13 fall 2D sprites or whatever fucking ever. King of Fighters 12 for as not good as it should have been look better than King of Fighters 13. Or maybe because I like them huge ass sprites as a fucking throwback to like old Art of Fighting 1 and Samurai Showdown maybe. That's just me. So, again, like I said, internet, calm your motherfucking asses down. We fucking relax. And let's wait about three or four months from now so they announce new characters and we figure out how the game work. And when the game finally come out, play the game for an hour. And then if you say you don't fucking like it after that shit, I will not argue you down. All the f- I just been on the internet all day preaching fuck the glass half empty, fuck the glass being half full. 
Be thankful you got a glass to fucking complain about. That's all the fuck I'm saying. I'm done. Did you have anything else you wanted to add to that at all? Anything? Um, no, you pretty much wrapped it up. Yo. Um, I think that brings us to a close. I think it does because we ain't got nothing else to talk about. TGS is all motherfucking... Yeah, I, I got to I gotta watch the other videos and shit of <laughs> um, TGS and we'll... Um, that you really, when you get the chance, get on my YouTube page, go watch the Gravity right. Rush shit. Oh my God. Catch back, okay, baby. gotcha. Yeah, man, yo, that shit right. looks fucking amazing. They got a, they got okay. some, they got some Resident Evil Call of Duty game out there, some fucking where, no, I think they got no a, I, yo, I don't know where the fuck they, I don't know where the fuck they get that niggas want to play Call of Duty Evil, nigga. <laughs> Is it, Wester running around, nigga, whooping behind niggas and cracking their necks? The answer is no. I can't fuck with you. And Resident Evil is a whole nother story. Yeah. It, we, yeah, we might have to save that for another time. No, nah, Resident Evil. Yeah. Oh, oh, you know what? Hey, 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 yo, shout out to white people who don't think black people play Resident Evil. You thought I forgot, did you, nigga? No, I didn't forget. Ha, what you now? What you what you niggers know about that fucking that fucking dragon's dogma? If you don't shut your motherfucking ass up, <laughs> I, nigga, you like you niggas think I forgot? You think I, I don't forget shit? I have a list of every motherfucker who ever insulted me. I keep a list on you niggas. You thought I forgot? What the fuck? And I and I quote: What you niggers know about dragon's dogma? And then I proceeded to tell this user to go commit suicide because his name had suicide in it. It was, it was pretty funny. Me and Jay went on. We we went at that nigga for we went at that nigga for a good minute. For he was just like, "Fuck it, I give up." Um, really quickly before we get out of here, I want to shout out Parkinson's Tyrone. He will fuck your wife, Michael J. Fox. Now was really good. You're an evil bastard. I'm not an evil bastard, nigga. Parkinson's Tyrone will fuck your wife, nigga. Parkinson's Tyrone will fuck your wife while he's shaking the D in your wife's pussy. Because he is Parkinson Tyrone and gives zero fucks. Parkinson Tyrone don't give a shit. Nigga, shout out to Daddy Donovan, nigga. Nigga, Daddy Donovan, nigga, I ain't never, I'd rather die not being a snitch, nigga. I told you he was going to come back on that ass, Jay. I told you. I told you he was going to come back on that ass. I told you. Nigga, nigga, Daddy Donovan don't stay in the low coon ranks for long. He rides above coons. He rides above all the coons. All the coons. He rides above them. I don't know, man. This, this, this season has been a low for him. I'm sorry. Nigga, this season been a low for everybody, nigga. Bunchy, bunchy wife and Mexicans, dog, for green cards and shit, nigga. This a low for everybody. Nigga, Parkinson's Tyrone about to fuck your wife. This a low for everybody. Nigga... Look, no, girl, nigga, no, look, girl, no, 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 look, girls trying to no, rape no, their teachers. No, no, that's not a low for him. That's, no, that's not a low for him. Oh, 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 man, oh, oh, no, oh, 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 so getting slayed, getting slayed, getting slayed out on um, to the brown man ain't going yeah. low, nigga. If he, if he can manage to do that shit to Ray, nigga, oh, that's gonna be off the chain. Um, hey, hey, nigga, hey, I want, hey, I want to shout out one time to my bitch Sharda, nigga, one time to my bitch Sharda. You know what I'm saying? I be getting between the matches, man. <laughs> That's a low. Hey, but a high one, nigga, you want to know what the high point of the season have been, though? For real? Every okay. time Ray Donovan kids act like Ray Donovan, dog. That has been the highlight of the season. Tell me I'm not lying, dog. Every Thank time you, you're right. You're every right. time the Ray Donovan comes out with his children, niggas get niggas whooping other niggas with baseball bats. Nigga, nigga, bitch a stole old girl in the mouth, dog. <laughs> y'all, y'all get nah, bitch in the mouth, dude. I think it was a nose, actually. I think it was a nose. I think it was a nose. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, nigga. She Ray Donovan, that bitch, though. That's all I'm saying, nigga. She Ray Donovan, that bitch. Ray Donovan, knockity mack, nigga. Knockity mack. Nigga. Nigga, shout out to Poochie Halls, nigga. He ran on. He ran away, nigga. He got like, nigga. I'm nigga. I'm sick of cooning out the daddy, nigga. I'm taking my white hooker and we out, nigga. 
He trying to Nigga, be. He, he took his crack away. He, he took his crack away, dog. <laughs> what you what, what you say? He did what? <laughs> he took his crack away, man. <laughs> And fuck the d- I'm done. I'm done. Oh my god. I'm done. I'm saying fuck you. It could be crack. Um, other niggas, we got a shout out real quick, nigga. Shout out to 25, nigga. Shout out to 25 Cent, nigga. Shout out to him, nigga. Salute, nigga. Okay, that's like, that's old, 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 old ass news. I know, but, but nigga, we don't ever get a chance to talk about this, nigga. So I'm just trying to bring it in as round, as close as we can. You know what I'm saying? I want to shout that nigga out. Um, nigga, nigga, shout out, shout, shout out my nigga Vane. Shout out him, nigga, nigga, nigga. We, nigga, nigga, Team JRF. We do not fuck with Flint like niggas. That's all we saying right now. We, all, nigga, we understand. We are, I, we, we here. We, we love everybody. We are an equal opportunity group. You know what I'm saying? We fuck with us, but we don't fuck with Flint like niggas. That's all we saying on the one time, dog. We don't fuck with you, Flint like niggas. If you niggas trying to be Flint like, you will be dealt with. That's all I'm saying. That's all the fuck I'm saying, nigga. We don't fuck with Flint niggas like that. You will get dealt with. I done, I done ran into a couple of Flint niggas on the internet today. You come, nigga, come to come to Shank Larceny. You will get dealt with, nigga. Murder Zuri, nigga. You will get dealt with. I'm just letting your ass know. Um. Um. For all my, for all, for all, cause I don't want to get into this, cause, cause we'll be here ten minutes. You talking about bug men and shit, nigga? Drive in next week, and I will talk about that on the cool when it happens, but. Shit got mad fucking real. Um, Ghost is up next, so... See, they not bug men. They ain't been bug men for years. One nigga was a shark. That was five. He was a shark. So everybody's not bug men. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Are you talking about century-ass niggas again? Oh, fuck you, bastard. God decade, decade, fuck. century, Decade century motherfuckers, man. These, these bug, bug creatures. Nigga, I keep telling you, I, I honestly think you would like Kamen Rider if you fucking watched it. It is not that, it's not Power Rangers. And anyway, it's real shit. Except niggas turn into superheroes and writer kick things. I really think you should give it a fucking try. I understand that, I know I'm beating, I'm beating, I'm beating a dead My Little Pony here. I'm, I'm punching a brick wall here. But I'm going to, when I see an opportunity for this shit, I'm going to try. I'm going to fucking try. When you are ready. Uh, I hear you. When you ready. I got that crack for you. When you ready. When you think you ready. I'm going to get you either on that double. Or that forze. Or that gun. I guarantee you, if you watch one of them. You will get in the Kamen Rider and you will want more. That's all I'm Check saying. this out. Check this out. I'm gonna shoot that century nigga and steal his antlers. Shut and I'm gonna wear them. Shut the fuck up. And and I'm gonna become a common rider, motherfucker. How about that? That's not how it works. That is how it works. You shoot and you kill one of them bastards and you steal their antlers and you become a common rider. That's not how becoming a common rider works, Jay. Yeah, you you you, you do. You you be you you you'll become a common rider. And start doing jumbo daily the kitty attacks or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know what that bullshit is that they do. It's bullshit. Whatever. I tried. I'm you just know, saying. I'm just saying. On yeah, the end, yeah, you tried. I'm like, nigga, there is Lost Streets of Rage audio where we had this conversation two years ago and it went the same exact way. But I felt I saw an open yeah. and I tried. You know, whatever. Nigga. When the fuck we getting on some videos, nigga? Let the internet know what's up, dog. Cause you, you, I know you too busy over there trying to be I, I have, I have no idea. Um, it, it has been a long time, and we need to start filming again. Yeah. And uh, I don't know. Wow. We, we're, we're gonna have to talk about that. We get together and see what we can work out. Okay. I'm just the internet. I just need the internet to know that 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 we are in a in a session. They're, they're, um, speaking of videos, 
me and Evil Freezilla, we got some shit coming real soon. I told my Facebook fans, like, what the fuck really hood, you know what I'm saying? I talked to him yesterday. Told him I, I got the, the the game on deck, so he ready to do the thing. So, internet, be ready for some more of them hot fighting game sets. I know internet's telling me they loving the motherfucking Raid of the Dragon. They want more of this shit, so I got you. But we gotta we got some games to get to because it's a lot of history that we gotta get through over these years of playing games, whether at the shop, at my house, his house, just things. So we're gonna get to that. We're gonna get to that. So keep your bitches on. We got you. Um fuck slavery Steve. Just had to say that live real quick. It's fuck slavery Steve. Now until the end of time, cause slavery Steve a bitch. Slavery Steve can't do right. nothing but hold these L's. Slavery Steve, hold L's, nigga. You love master. Hold L's, nigga. I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm gonna beat your ass at Ultimate Ninja Five, nigga. And Ultimate Ninja Stone. Uh, Ultimate Ninja Five, beat that ass, Steve. You know what it is, nigga. Don't play, nigga. Dead or Alive and Stream Beach Volleyball, nigga. They coming out with a part three, nigga. Beat that ass, Steve. But beat that ass. What's up? You don't want this. Slavery Steve ass, nigga. You know, Slavery Steve don't want beef, nigga. He love massa, nigga. He love massa. He ain't trying to be for real, niggas. He ain't trying to do that shit. Um, anything else? Or are we done here, dog? Cause, like, yeah, I, I think we're done. I, I have to watch some more trailers, and we might do this again. Yeah, we we might have one more of these for the end of the week. Cause TGS is a, a strange, strange place. Um, I don't know what they're gonna do about Street Fighter Five Internet. Because they just announced, they just announced uh, Osama bin Laden's little nephew Rashid and shit. You know what I'm saying? He, he a terrorist. I just said that live. Right. And, uh, Osama. And that nigga a beast. The uh, initial character roster. Um, Sixteen. That's the initial character roster. Right now we got Ryu, Ken, Sean, Kenny, Bison, Charlie, Nikali, Vega, Rainbow Mega. And Rashid, am I missing somebody? Oh, Birdie, okay. Birdie, um, and I think that's it right now. What, what's the rumor? What's the rumor going around that my girl might be in it? They say it was a list a while back that right now, according to the internet, is matching up to the initial sixteen. So it's supposed okay. to be two more new characters. It's supposed to be Alex. Urian and your girl Karin. That's what the internet is saying right. right now. I can't confirm or deny any of that shit because I don't get in the middle of fighting game community dick wanking. I got information shit because y'all just a bunch of hoes anyway. But, but, you do what y'all do over there in that corner. Y'all do what y'all do. Y'all go jack off and mark up and all that bullshit over there in the corner with your homies and shit. You do that. Holler at me in 2016 when it's a video game. By then, Jay would have helped me find a fucking HGTV and I probably would have got a new computer and fucking recording equipment and I'd be up here bashing Bond and Street Fighter Five. So there you have it. There you fucking have it. Um. Oh, 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 just so I can throw it back to Decade niggas, um, we should be getting information about Bat Rock War Genesis this week too. So for all my Toku fam, you know what I'm saying? Watching for that shit. I want to know. Only motherfucker they had confirmed outside of the writer that were in that trailer was fucking Kaiser here because his voice actor is coming. His actor for the show is coming back to do the voice for the game. So that's all we know right now. There's a new Gundam Versus game for the PS Vita. Which makes me wonder that is Japan the only country in the world that knows the Vita still exists? I don't know. The game looks fucking hot. And as long as it has Alan B. Beardley in it, I will purchase it with money. See, that's all you gotta do. Namco, you put Alan Beardley, Alan B. Beardley in a game with Gundam in it, I will buy it with money. If you don't, I will not buy it with money. So I'm just letting you know that live. Letting you know that's what the business is. Alan B. Beardley equals my money. That's all you need to know about that. Um, there anything else that happened this morning that Talk about the no, nothing I can. I'm trying to think though, because I don't want to leave nothing on the table just in case we don't get a chance to do this again. Um, 
I've got nothing. I think I've talked about everything the fuck that Major League Concerned me. Oh, I just remembered. There's a new stage for Smash. That uh, uh, Mario Maker stage coming out the end of the month. For people, okay. for people who still play is, Smash. Is it, is it free? Is it free? I have no motherfucking idea. I would assume it would be. <laughs> it better be free. And if it's not? Then fuck it. Works for me. I just said fuck it to, to every DLC thing that they came out with because $7 for a character, you can suck my dick because that's a video game. I can go buy Shantae right now on PS4 for the price of Ryu. See what the fuck I'm getting at? There you have it. Yeah. There the fuck you have it. $7 for a motherfucking character? No, thank you. But the thing is, I know I'm going to have to buy it at some point because... Nintendo ain't never gonna put that shit on sale. Nintendo will never yeah. fucking put that shit on sale in a way that you know that I could fucking absorb it, absorb that cost and appreciate. Now the only way I fucking go buy some DLC is if Best Buy do that thing where they do like thirty percent off the fucking point cards again, like they did a couple of years ago. A shame I spent all them points. Fuck. What the fuck did I spend those points on? Oh yeah, I remember. I I had bought that dumbass Liberation Maiden. That bullshit. Oh Lord Jesus Christ. I bought yeah. li- I bought Liberation Maiden, and I think with the I think I had someone after I bought all that points. I had bought Liberation Maiden at some point. I had bought um, Dylan the second Dylan's Rolling Western. I bought Harmonite at some point, and then I think with the remainder of them points that I had, I fucking. I have fucking got um Azure Striker gun voting shit, which everybody should go play on Steam at this point. You should. There's no reason uh, unless they really are going to update the 3D version, the 3DS version, like they claim they are. Go play the Steam version, even though it's like super buggy and fucked up, because you can actually get the full story translated in English now. So go do that. But I think we done for real, right? We we talked about. Kingdom Hearts 2.8. Yes. Talked about a KOS. Everything, everything was on topic, and we're done. You, you don't get to say we're done. Nope. You don't get to do that. Do you? No. Yeah. No, you don't. No. I don't know what the fuck I want, bitch. You know this. <laughs> you, yeah, you get to do what the fuck you want in the illusion of your own motherfucking thoughts. This is real life, nigga. You don't get to do what you want here. Man, whatever you, hey, don't front. You you know what the deal is. Dog. I don't know what shit is, nigga. As far as far as far as what the you fuck you talking about, hey, concern, hey, nigga. Hey, 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 hold, hold all this shit down. You know what? You know what? Hold all this down. Let let let's not do this now. You, let's not do this now. Uh, are you trying to be professional, nigga? Oh wow. Yeah, yeah. Let's 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 not do this now. You, 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 the internet. You say the internet. Let's, uh, let's keep it presentable. You know, and let's. You know what? You my big brother. I can listen to real. I, I can do that. Alright, there you go. I'm right, the one of the only yeah, triple to G O D. You know who the fuck that nigga is over there. That's and I'm it. and I'm John King. Uh, who knows who the fuck he is at this point? Cause I sure don't. Um, thank you for joining Whatever. us for this for this special episode of you know Kingdom Hearts King of Fighters 14. Ray Donovan Kid will smack your motherfucking ass with a baseball bat and steal you in the mouth. Episode of Two Niggas Speak On. Um. We'll holler at you guys next time, man. Peace out.